My name is Linda Perry, and I am the chair of the Washington Park Neighborhood Association in Washington Park, the frontline community to the port. Couldn't be any more frontline. We smell it, I smell it every day. I see it every day. Therefore, I'm acutely aware of what is in the port and what doesn't belong in the port anymore. There is an opportunity to go green. And I would hope that our legislatures, the community there in the building behind us realize that, that we could eliminate all of this angst if we just focus on clean, green economy. It is the way of the future. It is now. It isn't even the future. It is now. We have auxiliary businesses from wind turbines. We have solar. We have land cable for the wind turbines out in the ocean. We are the premier industry in this region. We need to promote it and embrace it. The House, the Senate, Congress Corp, the money, the people with the money, and the hell with all these polluting industries. This technology, this high heat porosis or paralysis, paralysis of what it is, is an unproven technology. It is banned in other countries and they want to slam dunk it in our neighborhood. Totally slam dunk it in our neighborhood and skirt all the environmental regulations that goes around it. To me, that says dirty business dirty politics and it's just another bad way of doing business and we can't have that there's plenty of other well-deserved businesses that could be in the port that are not polluting and the heck with all these old places and this old way of thinking because this is 2022 this is not 1940 you know we got to look to the future and then embrace the act on climate we know what we need to do the people in the building behind me need to do it otherwise you know what there's a lot of us that live in the state of Rhode Island and we vote and we vote and we need to vote green if there's a politician out there that isn't green bye bye you know, because that's just not the way to be in this environment. We need to lead the way for green industry in the port. And there was other things I wanted to say, but there's other people that need to speak up as well. And thanks all for being here. Thank you.